Well, we'll turn again this morning in the Lord's Word to the book of Job and the 23rd chapter, Job chapter 23, and we'll still our hearts for a moment and commit the preaching of the Word now to the Lord. Lord, we thank you that we can truly sing, tis old, yet ever new. We can go to passages of Scripture that we have read many times, and we can see something fresh to bless and nourish the soul. We thank you that we can sing, tis ever true. For although men today would try and tell us that the Word of God is not relevant or it must be read in the context of the culture of the times. We thank you, Lord, that thy Word is true. Sanctify them by thy truth. Thy Word is truth. We pray that from the pages now the truth would shine like the day star would shine in our heart we would be fed on the finest of the wheat. Hear and answer prayer. Glorify thy Son in Jesus' name. Amen. My text this morning is found at the end of verse 12. We'll really examine verse 11 and 12 uh, together, but my text can be found to summarize the message at the end of verse 12 of Job chapter 23. I have esteemed the words...